Flick and CJ are two new special characters to New Horizons. These two lovable animals replace Nat and Chip who previously handled bugs and fish. The developers gave the two some new roles in New Horizons to keep them fresh and incorporate them into the weekly special character rotation. Now that we've been through almost an entire year of New Horizons, I find myself not using them at all which is unfortunate. Are you utilizing Flick and CJ to their utmost potential? First, let's start with Flick. This artsy chameleon loves bugs. So much so that he buys any bugs you catch with your net for 150% of what Nook's Cranny does. You can store bugs in your storage, in your house, or around your island if you want to take up the space and wait for him to return. Both Flick and CJ fall into the normal bi-weekly rotation of special characters. They each have a chance to show up once every nine days. So you could have those bugs sitting in your storage for nine whole days. If you haven't upgraded to the 2400 storage, you might want to consider it. Flick shows up at 5am and will stick around your island until 5am the following day. Which means that he's around after Nook's Cranny is closed, so no selling your bugs to the market box that eats 20% of your profit. Along with purchasing your bugs, Flick will also make a statue of whichever bug you choose. These commissions cost three bugs of whatever you want them to make. If you want a cool statue, make sure you save up your bugs. The butterflies are my favorite. Look how precious. You can only request one commission per visit. If you want multiple, you're gonna have to wait for Flick to return. Flick hosts the bug offs that occur four times a year in the summer months. Your goal for the bug off is to catch as many bugs as you can in three minutes. You'll get one point for every bug you catch and an extra two points if you catch at least three bugs. Sounds simple, right? Well, <laughs> It's not. You'll find that bugs seem to mysteriously disappear once that timer starts counting down. I'm no data miner, so I can't say for sure, but it really feels like their spawn rates heavily decrease when that timer is going. There are a few tricks you can do to get bugs to appear quickly. Drop a rotten turnip for almost guaranteed ants to appear, chop down a couple trees to make some stump bugs appear, hit up patches of flowers for bugs like butterflies that hang around the pretty colors. Make sure you give yourself enough room to run around your island. Those of you with a lot of terraform land and one path that goes around your entire island might have a hard time getting a lot of points. Every time you accumulate 10 points, you can turn them in for an exclusive bug off reward like furniture, clothing, and accessories. Every 100 points you get, you get a trophy. Bronze at 100, silver at 200, and gold at 300. These points can accumulate between bug offs and using them to acquire the exclusive items does not reduce your total number of points. Each bug off round costs 500 bells except for the first one, which is free. Next, Mr. CJ. He's basically the same thing as Flick, but instead of bugs, his obsession lies with fish. And streaming. This dude is obsessed with finding huge and rare fish to use as clickbait for his audience. CJ's random visit has one extra mission over Flick's. He requires you to complete a sea sports challenge. This usually involves catching three fish of a specific size, but in a row. So if you request a medium fish, you've already caught two and you accidentally catch a large fish, you're gonna have to start over and catch three more medium sized fish. After that, he works just like Flick. He'll buy your fish for 150% and he'll commission Flick to create fish statues for you for three of the same fish. They'll be sent to you in the mail the next day. CJ is also available from 5 a.m. until 5 a.m. the following day, so you can sell fish late night. CJ hosts the fishing tourney that occurs four times throughout the year. This basically works the same as the bug off. These also cost 500 bells per round, but the fish you catch will easily make up for it, especially with the 150% profit point on every fish you sell. You'll get exclusive fishing tourney rewards for every 10 points with the trophies at their respective points amounts, which are also the same as the bug off ones. You'll get one point per fish and an additional two points as a bonus for catching three or more fish. Stock up on bait, this helps a lot. The problem with the fishing tourney and the bug off is once you get those 300 points, you've done everything there is to do. Unless the developers add more furniture or new rewards, I'll never have to participate in any of these events ever again. The last fishing tourney I played one round just to get the Nook Miles achievement. You get an achievement for participating in each of the tourneys. Though it wouldn't be fair to the new players to miss out on the original event awards if they do indeed change it up. After a while of playtime, the only thing Flick and CJ end up being used for is completing your catalog with commissions if you're the type of person that likes to thousand percent games. Otherwise, the fish and bugs take up too much room in my storage to bother saving for Flick's and CJ's return to the island. Though if I do feel like enjoying some late night fishing, it's nice to know that CJ's got my back. I want to see more from them, specifically more tourney rewards. Games like Pocket Camp have so many cool furniture and clothing items for participating in events that change up all the time. The game even brings back old items so if you miss out you can still get them eventually. I was overly excited for how Pocket Camp's constantly updated, hoping that New Horizons would somewhat follow suit. We'll have to see how 2021 goes and see what the developers bring us. 
What do you like most about Flick and CJ? I just want Flick's net, man. This thing's really cool. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below and I'll see you next time. Bye. Da 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 da